Queen is a tile game here uh, from Korea that has been reprinted. This is an older game. I want to say it's like seven or eight years old. I never heard of it. And it is a very light game, but it uses those backlight tiles that I love so much. Let's see how it plays. There's tiles in each color from one to 16. Actually, there's two 16s of each. And there's a few other tiles. These will be put into a bag and split between the players where they will put them behind a shield. So what's gonna be happening here is on players' turns, you're gonna be making lines in the middle of the table. We'll start with the, the ones of each of the color that's out there. And on your turn, you can play a single tile. So I could put this eight here up to one, as long as it's higher. You can also play a series of tiles. So for example, I could play the 10, the 11, and the 12. The problem is you can't play anything that is that is lower. So once the 10, 11, 12 here are played, well, who, how are we going to play the 2 through 9? Well, there is one way to do that. If you play the 16 restart on a row, then the next tile can be any number. However, when you play the 16 end on any row, then nothing can be added to that row, not even the 16 restart. You can use scissors tiles if you have one of those to cut off a tile at the end of a row so then that you can then play maybe a single number or a group of numbers like I just did there. And there is a trash can, which will let you get rid of a whole pile of numbers if you want to from a row and then play more tiles at the end of that row. So this will keep going. If anyone gets rid of all the tiles behind their screen, they win the game. Otherwise, once everyone passes and can't play anymore, you'll add up the values of the numbers you have. And these, of course, are very expensive. I think they're 20 points each. And whoever has the least points is the winner. I was quite happy with this game. Very surprised at how much I enjoyed 16. 16 is, I mean, it's a really light game. It's kind of a shedding game where you're just trying to get rid of stuff, but there's just something fun and easy going about it. This is the kind of game I would pull out at a family gathering. Like, you guys mostly play dominoes or you mostly play Uno or whatever. Here's a game that offers some silly little choices as you put tiles out and you can just put out one tile or you put out that big group, but that big group might mean I don't get to put out that one tile. When do I use that 16 that restarts everything? That 16 end is mean. The scissor tile lets me get rid of the end, but it's not, I, we had a blast playing this as a family. I really enjoyed playing this with the kids and we played it over and over again. So it was a fun one to check out. Definitely not gonna be for everybody. If you're a big, deep, heavy gamer, you're gonna wanna ignore this one. But as a family game to pull out and the tiles are satisfying and it's, it's simple. The rules are a little hazy on but mostly how to put out the ones. But other than that, it's really easy to jump into and I like it a lot. That's 16.